Welcome to Mustangs Plus Restomod How To Series, and today we're going to install Gravitrack leaf springs. I'd like to show you a little bit about our springs. We have the Gravitrack series springs, and what we have here is a standard four leaf spring. We have a, a mid eye four and a half, and we have a reverse eye five leaf. And depending on how you, you're going to be driving your car will depend on which leaf uh, you select. Uh, in addition, we also have U-bolts in case your U-bolts are bad. We have I-bolts and we also have the racing performance shackles and we have the standard shackles that normally come with your car. But before we get going, I just want to remind everybody that's doing this at home that when you jack your car up, make sure your jack stands are right here in front of the I-bolt. That way you've got support and when you go to use your wrenches, you're not going to be interfering with any of your hand tools by the jack assembly. Okay, we're going to remove the shock. Got the shock hardware. Push up on the shock and just let it hang. Next, we're going to remove the U-bolts. Now you'll notice that this particular car has some uh, tow perches on it. This car is towed sometimes, so this is something that you can add if you decide you want to tow your car. Perch. U-bolts. Okay, now we'll move to the rear and remove the rear shackle. We've got two nuts to remove up here. We've got the plate that comes off. And then what we'll do is we're going to we're going to pull the whole shackle out and we'll drop this part of the leaf. We're going to take the load off the springs by jacking up the rear end just a little bit so there's absolutely no load whatsoever on the leaf springs. Take the load off. You can see the leaf lifted just a little bit. Now we can move the spring. Okay, we're ready to take this shackle kit apart. We've got a bushing coming out. We've got the shackle assembly and now we're just going to drop the spring, remove the eye bolt and we're ready to take the whole spring out. Okay, we're ready to take out this front eye bolt and here we go. We'll ratchet it off. Okay, we're ready to remove this whole leaf assembly. We're going to pull out this eye bolt. And here comes the whole leaf. This is it, right here. Okay, we're ready to put our standard leaf back in. And we're going to start with the eye bolt. We're going to lift the spring up. Get it in there. Okay, we're ready to install our rear shackle kit, and before we do that, we're going to give these rubber bushings a shot of WD-40, which will help get them to slide right inside. Just like that. And these upper bushings, they'll slide in this way once we get it mounted, and at the same time what we're going to do is we're going to give those a shot of WD-40.
and we're going to lift it up, get her installed. We've got the leaf spring in, all tightened down. We're going to lower our rear end onto the spring, and we're going to ensure that the center bolt is right in the middle of the perch. And what that does is that centers the rear end. We're ready to go. We're going to use new U-bolts. We're going to get this all tied in together. Okay, now we're going to get the shock absorber inserted. Get that in. Get the rubber bushing. Metal washer. Get the nut. And get it tightened down. Okay, we've got the leaf spring. We've got all the hardware, the shock. We've checked all our nuts, bolts, rear shackle kit, uh, and that pretty much finalizes our Gravitrack leaf spring installation.